Well, the Breba are ready. It's July 3rd. And this is my Genovese Nero, which for those who like the discussion about is Genovese Nero the same as Italian 258? The Breba are both getting ripe exactly on the same day. They've both been under the same exact conditions. It's July 3rd. Can't believe tomorrow's 4th of July already. Where's the summer going? And I've got some really beautiful ripe figs here that I I really need to, to pick to probably eh, that's that's really ripe. That's that's really ready to be picked. All of them all of them are ready. I'll let those other two I'll let them hang. Then over here I've got my Italian two fifty eight which is also getting ripe. I've got some Breba here, and they just look beautiful. That one there is just really ready. They're both ready. I'll just pick this one. See if I can... Every once in a while, I wish I had three hands, especially when I sit down to my favorite pasta dishes, <laughs> and sometimes when I'm picking figs and trying to take a picture at the same time. These two varieties need no introduction. Everyone loves them. They're just great, and I've done another video on them so keep them separate so give me one little second here wow <laughs> that is nice this is the Genovese Nero it's just beautiful that is beautiful going to give it a taste Full of syrup and nectar. Beautiful thing. Wow. That's good. That is a delicious fig. Mm. I wish I had a hundred like it. Not a, a real rich berry flavor, just a rich flavor. Sweet, just the, uh, the perfect blend of sweetness. The perfect, just a just a delicious taste. I can't wait next year to get this particular variety, both of these, and I think they're the same. Doing some air layering. I'm gonna have more varieties or more of the same variety. And I can't wait to get it in the ground next year. And I'll use A grow bag and plant it in the ground in the early spring as soon as 
danger of frost is over and I'll use the technique I've been using cutting holes three inches from the bottom of the grow bag one inch holes one and a half inch holes seven or eight around the circumference of a five gallon pot and I'll put it in the ground and it might be even better it's hard to say <laughs> it's hard to imagine how it could be much better but it it will taste better in the ground and certainly in the grow bag because the roots will reach out for additional nutrients into the good earth the natural way the way it was intended like it happens in California and like it happens in Italy and Greece there's no difference that I can discern between the grow bag method burying the grow bag in the dirt all the way and actually putting the tree in the ground to grow wild in the ground except for it makes more figs because the roots remain compressed and You've got more control over it and you can pull it out in the winter time and put it into a winter protected spot in the house, in the basement, in the fig cellar, wherever you store it, attached garage. So there you have it. I, I think they're the same. The leaves are the same. The vigor, the vitality, of the trees is exactly the same this was just a little baby the Italian 258 got a later start last year than did the Genovese Nero it was just a single leaf when I purchased it and it needed to be nursed along Big Bill that off the beaten path nursery he kept it for me and said, Louie, let me keep it for a little while because I'm afraid it might not survive. It was so fragile. I said, sure. And he did. He nursed it for a few more weeks. and It made it. Long story short, it made it. It's a little behind my Genovese Nero, but it's doing awful darn good. Real good. It's going to make a lot of fruit. Plenty of fruit. It's very vigorous, very healthy. And I'm looking forward to every single fig on these trees. Have a good day for whatever it's worth. If you don't have these in your collection already, these are figs you can count on. They need a little early start, but not much. You can do it even without a greenhouse. I seldom keep my figs in a greenhouse, as I've said. Well, thank you for listening. Have a great day.